Hey there guys, we Neo here and welcome back to another, uh, oops, I was all tabbed out of it, sorry. <laughs> welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Far Cry 3. We are right back where we left off last time. And in the last episode I tried to take on an outpost that really made me want to staple my butthole shut. And let me tell you, I almost did. I had the stapler and the stapler's ready and everything was ready and I decided in the end not to. Whoa! I'm practically already in the encampment. <laughs> what the hell's going on with this encampment? There's so many buildings and things to look at. What the heck? Ooh. Okay, no grunting. That'll set them off real good. I see a lot of opportunities for things I've learned. But I get the feeling that I'm not going to be able to execute them. That's a uh, that's a hell of an entrance there, boys. Just kill me now. Oh my goodness gracious. What a start to an episode. How was I supposed to know that guy was there? Come on. He was like tucked away in the corner. Well, now I know. I would like it if this game would start me right in front of that outpost again. Of course, I guess we'll see. Man, I had a plan and everything going into there. I'm so sad I lost that. I was like, alright, take down the heavy, take down the sniper, double take down two guys. Good to go. Lo and behold, they had to go and fuck it up. The sniper almost saw me. Oh, that's how I would have seen him. Okay. I feel like there's a lot more guys in this outpost than what I can see. Okay, don't fall off, dude. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot more people in this outpost than what I can actually see at the moment. You didn't hear nothing. What the fuck? Okay, so... Alright, alright. <sighs> Let's talk about this real quick. This is not going to be easy. Not in the slightest. I have to... When I drop down onto the roof of the buildings, I have to... The guy's going to get distracted and he's going to hear me and he's going to try to go inside the buildings, correct? I have to then throw a rock, lure him out, and do a top-down takedown. <laughs> Which, by the way, is the new official name for it, top-down takedown. And I have to wreck his ass in the best way possible and make him my bitch but unfortunately only a contingency in this plan will possibly be the heavy you know what I need? I need a good bed I need to not be so loud when I jump down from these things isn't there like a perk I can get that's like soft landing or something Oh boy, if only you were five inches out more. That got the heavy's attention too, son of a bitch. I knew it would too. I was like, I swear to god if this does. This is a son of a bitch. If I drop down there, I'm probably going to get stuck forever. This might be a better situation. No more 
heavy. Now the sniper, he likes to change sides. So I'm not going to go for him until he changes sides again. Man, that guy is traveling a lot. Sniper is changing signs. Do I hear cage? Caged animal of some type? I do. It's another Komodo dragon though. Hey, he took down two people. Took down three people. Holy shit. You did better than me. <laughs> I got this. You don't got shit. Sorry, my finger itches. I don't know what the heck that's all about. Whoop. Damn bugs. Slide into place to execute my next tactic. Executing next tactic, that is. Assuming that these are the last two guys in this place. Holy shit. Ah. Well, you done fucked up my not seeing thing. And there was another guy. Oh well. I mean, let's think about it. Let's honestly think about how worthwhile experience is at the moment. If I truly think about it, I think I've gotten all the skill points that I want to get, like that I think are super helpful in the long run. So I'm thinking that money and experience, well, experience more so, isn't the most important thing at the moment. We have the outpost. No but rares. Still more to do. Check out the jobs on the bulletin board. I wonder if I've done all the rare hunting missions. I think I have. But I wouldn't be wouldn't rule it out completely yet. Be better to travel to Gaztown and then go south to get to this place. Speaking of which, Gaztown. Sounds like the uh, YouTuber Gaz. I hope my friend. Okay, I guess I'll just travel south on foot since I don't see any vehicles. Bye. is nice relaxing stroll through the uh, mountainsides like I hit a loading screen but it hasn't hit me yet it hasn't yelled at me or no maybe never mind I'm back in explored territory my bad I was looking at my mini map thinking what the heck's going on it's first aid here how's there not like a gliding thing here I do have a wingsuit I think I can make it. And I'm free. Free falling. Okay, I don't want to be that free falling. Holy shit, I'm gonna land right in their base. Oh, hey guys, I'm here to kill y'all. Jesus Christ. Jason! Jason! <gasps> that was the lowest frame rate crash I think I've ever experienced in my life. 
Anyways, let's scope the place out. See if there's any babes. I don't see any. All I see is assholes. Assholes as far as the eye can see. Hey guys. I'm out in the open, but I'm not in your territory, so you can't shoot me yet. Oh man, they got people all over the place. I'm just now realizing this. Uh, vantage point seen, and I'm taking it. Do -do -do. I'm just gonna sneak in here. Sneak in and touch your butts. I guess that's my plan. I'm sticking to it. I swear if this guy turns around. Man, why is everyone looking at me now? It's like everyone was like, well, someone died. Let's all turn around and face that direction. There's like these three assholes who travel around in a pack. Make my life difficult. Alright, fine. Be that way. These guys are douche nozzles. There's no easy way around this. Holy cow. Now that I think about it. That'll get their attention away. Son of a bitch. I'm on the building. He's got hacks. Oh, that went pretty quick. <laughs> Again, sloppy, but that's what I get for being careless, I guess. I'll still accept no alarms triggered, though. I don't care if I'm going for silver nowadays. Because I already got the gold. I don't even know what that means, but hey, we're going to stick to it. That's my story. Where's the door? Okay. I got a memory card. <laughs> I don't know why I pulled out my camera. I'm gonna take a picture. And a joint. We gotta hit the gun, Jamon. Stop it! I don't wanna look at memory cards. Who does that? I mean, I did it back in like the N64 days, but not anymore. Holy cow. I'm trying to force these memory cards in my face like I'm a cameraman or something. Good work. Good work indeed. Oh wait, back to gas town. We lose our vehicle. Yay. I guess we'll take that last radio tower and then take that last outpost. And then we're going to go a double dog dam and we're going to end the game. Just kidding. I have wishful thinking at the butt right now. I hate not having that radio tower because I can't see if there's any vehicles in nearby that I may or may not want. I do see the radio tower up the road though. I'm gonna guess to get to it I have to take the high road though. Maybe I'll find some kind of a place where I can wingsuit from here. Or a Humvee or something. A Humvee? You heard me. Okay, well here's the path that leads to radio tower, I think. I'm just swing my pistol, swaying it back and forth. Uh, 
Okay, we made it. It wasn't too difficult. I guess I got lucky with the last two radio towers. Alright, load in the texture so I know where to go on this. Them jumping ones. Oh shit! <laughs> How did I fall outside the fence? Ay ay ay! I fail at even climbing radio towers. How do you like it? All right. Where do I go from here? It's an odd way to go. I don't know if that was the right way that I'm supposed to climb this thing, but I did it. Um. Changing your rope textures on me, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. How are the... Oh. Be very, very quiet and careful. The heck? Am I supposed to? Oh shit! Okay, we're good. No worries. Oh. Okay, we're good. No worries. <laughs> this thing just is a son of a bitch. And I had no idea where to go. But now I do. It's one of those ones where I gotta go back down to go up. Yeah. Okay. No more climbing radio towers for us. What do your elven eyes see this time? We have got way up at the top of the mountain, we got a little shack and a warehouse. Down the bottom of the mountain, we got what looks to be the place I came in at. And we got a cave right next to this radio tower. I'm sure there's interesting stuff abound inside that cave. Not the very least that I'm concerned about exploring. <sighs> There's a relic in there. I guess that's what it's pointing me to. There is this North Creech Crest. The Bushman is free in stores. Oh, is this the relic? Sweet. I thought this was going to be like a huge cave network that I'd have to go through. Never mind, that's easy. Yep. Alright. Now where is this outpost that I want to take? It's like right next to me. And a Screech. Oh no! I'm out. Whew, imagine if I was still in that. What a wonderful trip that would have been. <laughs> okay, don't slide into the fire now. That would be drastic. Not giving away my position at all. Uh, I'm not here to kill you guys. I'm just here to hang out. I didn't just drive a car about five seconds down a mountain before crashing it. Ooh. Excellente vantage point, eh? Says a me, eh? Uh huh. This place wants me to go all over the place. Snipers galore up in here. My dogs are barking. Well, 
Like we'll be able to take this without too much trouble. Hey, I found everybody. Hmm, this is one of those places that you really need a cage. An animal cage. Best course of action is slide down this thing. Since I already killed that guy. Should light these guys on fire a little bit. Might be worth looking into. Since, well, they were all bunched up. There's an explosive barrel right there. Dude's laying down on the job. What an idiot. Maybe not. That heavy would see me if I killed him. Ay ay ay, there's no safe place, no safe way to get out of here, as a matter of fact. Every which way is going to have someone watching it, so this is going to be a little complicated. think we're gonna move. We're gonna make a move, that is. For this heavy. We're gonna forget about all the guys up front here. We're gonna take them all out one by one. I need to find a better hiding vantage point. You dumb motherfucker. Dude had lipstick on him. Had it all over his lips. Let's do this indeed. Bada boom, baby. <coughs> That's two failures on outposts and then a success on one. Well, partial successes. Still not rare. I'm still convinced that I've done all the rare ones. Okay, so. Oh, holy shit, like. <laughs> Talk about the easiest outpost to attack ever. I got a base or a fast travel right next to it. 
So let's do it. Let's take the final outpost. And then we'll probably end this episode there. And then next time you guys get to look forward to just a hundred and... How the hell do I get out of this place? Okay. A hundred and twenty percent story with no interruptions. At least I hope not. Uh, ooh. Now my cats are meowing. What the heck's going on today? Is the apocalypse coming? Apocalypse now? I assume this pathway will take me there. Of course, when have I ever followed pathways? Well, okay. I thought the, the base was going to be over that ridge. So you don't want to go flying in on a car. That would not be the wisest idea. Man, I hate these outposts that are all tucked away in these tight ass corners. Doesn't even look like anyone's here. What the heck? Am I too far away? Have they not loaded in yet? I can tell that whatever. Okay. This outpost just got a lot more difficult. <laughs> I can see one guy. Two. Cheetah. It's a tiger, not a cheetah. Get over yourself, dude. Well, this shouldn't be too difficult, right? Goodbye, sniper guy. So I slide in for the kills. Actually, I should disable the alarm first. So let me do that. This outpost really does look like there's like no one in it. Okay. Scratch that. Holy shit. Yeah, holy shit's right. Go explore shit, it while I kill you. This dude. If you stay down, then I'm gonna take you down. Or, never mind. <laughs> if you stay down, I won't take you down. So, how comfortable is this guy out in the open? Not very comfortable, I guess. I would like to free this tiger. Sick him upon what I think may or may not be the last two people in this place. Go, my tiger. Go explore your wildest dreams. Oh hey, more people. Are they freaking out the tiger or me? I think the tiger is bigger of your two problems here, guys. Maybe. Like I said, if I take you down, or <laughs> never mind. I don't. I forgot my saying like five seconds after saying it. Kill him. Oh shit! Oh okay. Woo! I thought he was coming after me. I was about to cry. I was literally about to. Tears would flood out of my face. Now he might be coming after me. Oh shit, son. There's still a man left. There is a man child over there. So who's got the sniper rifle? You can't see me from here, son. One up ya. Ten ways till Sunday. 
Island Liberator, oh my god, you play achievements? So crucial to my success. Well, that was fun times, right? All outposts taken, all radio towers taken, my asshole taken. Liam Neeson's gotta find it. Next time, you guys, we will continue with the story and maybe. Oh, stop it, you guys. Dude, like, sniff my armpit. I'm out of here. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Far Cry 3 when we will continue with the story going forward. Thank you for watching. We and you. Bye bye.